morning everyone today is a wednesday just woke up it's about half past eight and i've decided i just want to vlog because i haven't made a youtube video in so so long and i miss it so much and i've been thinking so much about vlogmas and even though i know i can't do a video a day um or a vlog a day every day in december i really still want to ramp up my youtube video making um so it's back at where it was over summer especially because in a uh, at the end of this week after uni i'm gonna have a lot more time on my hands so that should be really really fun so today i've got kind of a day off uni i do have some dissertation stuff to do but i'm doing some other kind of exciting things and i thought why not just vlog just to get back into the flow of things and have a great time so the plan for today is i'm gonna uh, get up now do some yoga um get dressed get ready sort some things out have my life together go to my dissertation meeting i say go to it's it's a virtual dissertation meeting and then my friend Chloe is going to come over because it's the 2nd of December today. Oh, also, happy December. Happy Christmas time. Um, it's the 2nd of December today, so that means lockdown is over and Cornwall's in tier one, baby. So my friend Chloe's going to come over. She's going to take some photos of my plants for her, for one of her projects she's doing. And we're going to take some really cool Instagram pics as well. And then I've got some really fun things to organise, like some stuff I'm sending to New Zealand for Angus's mum. And a really cool giveaway so i'm gonna put some yoga clothes on and get started with that and then we can crack on with the day Okay, so does anyone else spend like far too much time doing their makeup and then you like look at the clock and you're like whoa but like this is so extra for today what have i done took me like half an hour <laughs> so long okay right at least i'm ready for the day my dissertation meeting is in 10 minutes so i'm gonna have a quick speed clean of the room and then jump on my team's call with my dissertation tutor and get rocking I started getting really bad headaches after like looking at my laptop and my phone for too long so I'm trying whenever I'm like on my phone or my laptop to wear these because they like block the bad rays really I thought you were gonna be like Emily <laughs> Okay, long time has ha long time has happened. Wow, a long passage of time has gone since I last turned the camera on because my phone told me that it was out of storage. So basically, that's peak. Um, finished my dis meeting. That went well, and now we have a visitor. This is so <laughs> weird having someone in my like know, after lockdown. This crazy, is crazy. But yeah, Chloe's now here to take some photos, and yeah, we're gonna have a great time. 
let's go. <laughs> okay, right, so we've taken loads of photos. I didn't film it because I just, you know me, get carried away. But Chloe's brought me a little present and I want to show you it before we head out to take some to kick something before we head out to take some photos around Falmouth so I'm going to spin you around and show you so if you don't know Chloe runs a small biz called Chloe's Creations I will tag it on screen and in the description box I think she's ah! <laughs> I love them oh my god in hoops yes <laughs> yes um Oh my god, I love, I love, I love. So actually, I've got a line drawing from Chloe over there and my swimming ladies, swimming ladies, sunbathing ladies are over there and oh, she started making these gorgeous. These ones are the Christmas decorations, aren't they? Yeah. Oh my god, I love them. So these are baubles for the Christmas tree. I am so excited. These will go so well with my macrame ones and <gasps> little bubble hat hoops. <laughs> I love these so much. Look how cute they are. Ignore my... Ignore those. I love them. Thank you so it's much. Okay. That is so cute. Eee! So we've come to this road with all the pastel houses and I've popped the earrings on that Chloe got me and we're going to take some photos in front of the pastel house with the pastel... Well, not the pastel, but the pink earrings in front of the pink house. We're gonna get some photos. We're gonna get some good photos. We are some banging photos. It's gonna be good. Right, let's go. Okay, so we've been walking along Falmouth High Street and I just realized we've never been in Dolly's, which is this little vintage tea room. Um, and apparently they're open because obviously it's the first day out of lockdown so we're going to go in and have a little look around which is exciting because apparently they do like little vintage like teapots. teapots and stuff which is really cool And Earl Grey, and Chloe's gone for mm -hmm. like an orange, I don't know what she called it. Orange polenta cake. It's made with like little granules of things. So I'm home now. Chloe's just headed back to hers. It's actually like four o'clock, which is ridiculous. We were out for so long. We had such a nice time. Um, we actually popped into Whistlefish, which is a little shop in Falmouth get it out for you um i bought christmas cards they have a deal on at the moment which is like 15 christmas cards for eight pounds and they're all like it's like an independent shop so i think that's just amazing and they're all um illustrated really wonderfully and not mass produced which is insane but i'm gonna show you them because i think they're really cute so i'm gonna try and oh, wow um so they're all really gorgeous um and they're all Oh, sorry, I had a hiccup. They are all so gorgeous. I just think they're lovely. Some really like nice feminine ones and some more masculine ones. Um, honestly, they're just oh, I love that one. But yeah, so I just picked up a load of those, um, which I just think was so good. So that's all my Christmas cards bought now from a small independent high street shop, which is double points yeah so basically i'm gonna spend the rest of the evening chillaxing um i think me and angus are gonna have date night tonight finally we've been waiting since saturday for date night but we're gonna have some nice food for dinner i'm gonna post my instagram later oh i know what i was gonna show you um i don't know whether i mentioned earlier i can't remember but if i didn't already mention we took some photos of something very exciting this morning and it's down here and i'm gonna show you my 5k giveaway that is right um that's it's literally 
freaking insane that I've got now 5,000 plus followers on Instagram. I'm like so overwhelmed with love and appreciation for everybody. So as a big thank you, I wanted to do a giveaway um, and we took some photos for that today. So I'm gonna give you a quick little tour um, of some of the items that I'm giving away. And um, I'm sure that the giveaway will be up by the time that this video goes up. So make sure you go and head over to my Instagram to go and enter. I'm just gonna shut up now and I'm gonna show you what's in there. So this is the box of goodies that I'll be giving away. I featured some of the Lush products on my Instagram a couple of days ago to give you guys a little hint. Um, I've also got some handmade soap, um, a candle that smells like lavender, um, some makeup palettes from autonomy so we've got this one called the blues and i designed these to be nice and funky so we've got like a blue cool toned palette and a kind of a more of a pop pink palette some more warm colors so you get both of those my favorite shampoo color wow um this is amazing it literally will take all of the badness out of your hair and leave you with just gorgeous silkiness the moon and her friend by charlie Woolley. Um, honestly the most amazing poetry book I love her poetry I've got one of these books myself um, and it's just all inspiring self-love poetry a little Korean face mask um, snow fairy a sleepy bubble bar marshmallow world bath bomb and a scrubby body butter with some nice exfoliating bits in there and this this is thrive and um, this is a CBD oil that I absolutely love you guys know i love cbd um, and this is in a peppermint flavor which is how i usually like my cbd so it doesn't taste like gross cbd um so you guys will get a little bottle of this in there as well um and you will also get some digital drawings and a nice little card as well and some sweeties so yeah basically that's the giveaway i would absolutely love for you guys to go and enter you are welcome to go head over to my instagram the link is in the description box below and yeah this will be great fun i'm so excited to launch it on insta i think you guys will love it i actually now can't chill for the rest of the evening i actually now have to go and post angus's mum's christmas present which is really exciting i would show you what i've got her but she sometimes watches my videos so i don't want to give it away before it gets to new zealand um so i'm gonna go post that now and i'll be back with you in a bit bye God, it's been a while since I last picked up the camera. I've just been chilling, doing boring things. Like, I went to the post office. Actually, my mum FaceTimed. That was nice. I spoke to my family. Um, tidied my room a little bit and have just posted on Instagram. Posted the look to my 21 buttons and done all the associated things. <laughs> um, and I'm actually so hungry because I forgot to eat lunch. Like, even though me and Chloe had tea and cake, which was lovely... I, d I haven't had a proper meal yet today so I think I'm gonna go and make pasta probably and yeah have a nice dinner I'm probably gonna make like tomato pasta sauce <laughs> Okay, so I've just eaten tea and we going to edit some photos that were taken on my phone today. Um, and earlier I deleted Lightroom because I didn't have enough space on my phone and it wasn't clearing in time. And I just thought like Lightroom takes up so much room, I'm just going to delete it and re-download it later. I'm going to cry. <laughs> Basically, I've lost all of my presets. That's like six, seven months of work has gone into those presets and there was like seven or eight that I used regularly and maybe seven or eight more that I used left often but were still proud of and I'd made them rather than downloaded them so it's not like I can just re-download them. Feel so thick. <laughs> Good cry. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. <laughs> I'm such a stupid bitch. <laughs> I mean, I had it on like color presets, and I just had to like tap the option. The drop down box came down. And it was like user presets. So I was like, ah, there they are. <sighs> oh. <laughs>